Welcome to Off the Wire. The University of Miami's experiment in late night comedy mixed with a natural college in the maturity. Tonight's guest, Professor Jeffrey Stern. And now, here's your host, here's Johnny Savage. Hey guys, Full House, what is this? Um, well, good evening, and uh, welcome to Off the Wire. For those of you who do not know, we've been here for a full year for this uh, current season, and the world has blessed us with many interesting headlines. So tonight, we'd like to recap some of those, uh, some of our favorites for you guys. Uh, this year, uh, McDonald's proposed putting 3D printers in their restaurants to print Happy Meal toys for children who didn't get the toy that they wanted. Local dildo enthusiasts were pleased. Uh, we also learned this year that for the last 15 years, the mayor of Talkeetna, Alaska, has been a cat named Stubbs. 15 years in office would make him the oldest cat mayor in all of Alaska. <laughs> what else happened this year? The Catholic Church got a new pope. Um, besides being the first Jesuit pope and using public transportation, Pope Francis only has one lung. Now, doctors say that this is totally fine, however, as the papacy leaves most of its blowing to its younger members. <laughs> Ryan Seacrest and Julianne Huff broke up this year. Said Huff, I'm just not the man he wanted me to be. <laughs> the Federal Centers for Disease Control and Prevention has found attention deficit hyperactivity disorder in nearly one in five. Nearly 4,500 Thai contestants celebrated after setting a world record for the most people dancing with hula hoops simultaneously in one place. This after a single Thai toddler set a world record by making 4,500 hula hoops in one hour. <laughs> President Obama made history this year by naming the country's first ever woman director of the Secret Service. So get ready to know everything about the Secret Service. <laughs> a couple was arrested for making dog porn this year, which we loved. But uh, contrary to popular belief, they were tried on copyright infringement that there's already a movie about a dog who likes balls in his face. <laughs> a 74-year-old man was fined in England for allegedly masturbating on a bus with shampoo. Said the man, I was just trying to empty my Johnson & Johnson. <laughs> New York authorities this year found 850 illegal snakes in an animal control officer's home. Now the owner tried to explain himself, but the authorities didn't speak parcel tongue. A man in Arkansas revealed how he was going to murder an ex-employee after accidentally butt-dialing him. Uh, he's in jail now, where he'll definitely be on the other end of aggressive booty calls. <laughs> Lastly, a New Mexico man was stopped for a minor traffic violation and then subjected to several invasive anal probings as he was searched for drugs. In other news, Ryan Seacrest is reportedly running every stop sign in New Mexico. <laughs> And those are our favorite uh, stories from the year. Stick around. We'll be right back with more Off the Wire. 